Are you managing Apple devices for your business or school? Do you need a powerful yet easy to use solution for device management? Well, we got you covered because in today's video, we are diving into Kanji, one of the most advanced Apple MDM solutions out there. So let's begin. Now, if you go to the official website, which is kanji.com, basically it's a mobile device management or MDM solution designed to help IT teams remotely manage and secure Apple devices like Mac, iPhone, iPad, and Apple TV. Kanji is offering a free trial, no credit card required, free access to all features for 14 days. All I have to do is click this button right here that would forward you to this section and all I have to do is provide the information that is needed like work email, HQ location, data center location, desired subdomain, number of Mac devices and of course number of other Apple devices. And then after that, you should be able to access the platform without any problem. But if you're not comfortable signing up for a free demo account and you don't want to share information you just wanted to gain insights through the official website let me tell you that kanji has five sections on the top corner wherein you can learn a lot of the platform the product pricing resources customers and company now let's get over to the product because in the product section you would notice it is subdivided into solutions by device and features. Let's talk about the device management. This is basically the core function of Kanji, allowing IT teams to remotely manage Apple devices and enforce security policies, deploy software, and ensure compliance. So basically, it acts like a locking, wiping, or sending commands to devices to ensure devices meet security requirements. All right, so all I have to do if you want to utilize the powerful purpose-built tools for a seamless Apple device, click the Start Trial. If you go back to the products and click the Endpoint Detection and Response, this focuses on real-time threat detection and response to protect Apple devices from security risks such as malware and cyber attacks. It detects suspicious activity on Mac OS endpoints. Basically, it takes action like quarantining files or isolating devices it works with siem or security information and event management systems for reporting that means it will provide you analytics on potential security threats the next section is going to be the vulnerability management wherein this section helps identify track and remediate security vulnerabilities in Apple devices before they are exploded. So it ensures Mac OS and iOS dis, uh, devices receive the latest security updates because it automatically scans for outdated software, weak security settings, and misconfiguration. We go to the I Mac OS device management. Now, this section focuses on managing your Mac computers. So the MDM or the Mac device management installs and updates applications and on Macs remotely. It enforces policies like file vault or disk encryption, gatekeeper, which is kind of really helpful. And then they also provide you with the firewall settings, security. It executes commands, update OS versions, and track new device performance. If you go to the iOS device, you will be surprised that this section is dedicated to managing iPhones and iPads within an organization. Basically, you can control features like camera usage, Bluetooth, or even Wi-Fi access. You can lock or erase lost or stolen iPhones or iPads. Now, it also offers you to streamline user authentication and app access. And of course, it automatically updates or remove apps on iOS devices remotely, which is very good. All right. Now, the next section is going to be the features. So, can Kanji provides different features 
for you to help with your IT teams manage, secure, and automate Apple device management. So number one is going to be the Kai. It is an AI-powered assistant designed to help IT teams manage and, of course, troubleshoot Apple devices more efficiently. All right? You have all of these. Go fast and insightful answers to any questions about your Apple devices at work. All you have to do is click on the request and invitation. You will be forwarded here. And, of course, Kai is available in Alpha to a limited number of customers. All you have to do is, again, provide all the information needed. Now, the next feature that I'm going to discuss is the Migration Agent. It helps IT teams transition to Apple devices from one MDM, for example, Intune or other MDMs to Kanji without resetting or losing data. That means you can seamlessly move Mac OS devices to Kanji without wiping them. It preserves existing apps, settings, and configurations. Now, we're going to the next tool. Or features which is going to be the compliance it's a very straightforward tool or feature that ensures all managed apple devices meet organizational and industry security standards next is going to be the integrations wherein it offers various third-party tools to enhance workflow automation and security so you can connect with identity providers such as okta you know google workspace Azure, Asset Bot, Asset Panda. So there's basically so much third-party apps right here that supports API integrations to extend the functionality into other systems. The next feature that I'm going to discuss is the lift off. Basically, it's an automated device setup and onboarding feature allowing employees to receive pre-configured Macs and iPads without IT involvement. Now, the next in is going to be the auto apps. Basically, this one is a feature that allows IT teams to deploy, update, and manage third-party applications automatically. So it supports silent app installations with no user interaction required. Cool, right? Next is going to be the assignment maps. It is a feature that allows IT teams to automatically assign blueprints, configurations, and policies based on specific devices attributes so for example if you want to assign specific settings like user role for admin or employee or uh, like a location or department it automates device grouping and policy enforcement reducing manual work by dynamically applying custom configuration now another cool thing about uh, kanji is the prism because it is a real-time device monitoring tool providing insights into Mac and iOS device health, security, and compliance. The next is going to be the Passport, which is I, I very like this handy tool. It enables power passwordless Mac logins using single sign-on or SSO providers like Okta, Google Workspace, and Microsoft Entra. And then there is the Manage OS. Now, it's a straightforward handy feature that automates Mac OS and iPad OS and updates to keep devices secure and compliant. Basically, Kanji provides a comprehensive Apple device management solution with features that enhance security, automation, and user experience. From zero-touch deployment to passwordless logins, IT teams can now efficiently manage Apple devices without manual intervention, saving you time. All right? And that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next one.